Access to clean water is difficult for people living in the arid parts of Kenya. Due to climate change and more frequent droughts, water holes and rivers dry up more often, posing challenges for families trying to survive. A challenge that Kenyan startup Magic Water is helping to meet using this water generator. The device, made by the Watek company in India, pulls humidity from the atmosphere using an industrial fan. The moisture is trapped in silica gel before it's condensed using refrigerating gas that creates liquid water. The founder, Beth Koigi, says the generators can produce up to 500 liters of water a day. Drought season are becoming quite regular, and the whole purpose for these systems is to enable communities to access clean drinking water without depending on the traditional water sources. So in regions where if borehole water dries or, or rivers, temporary rivers dries, communities can access clean drinking water. At least 25 water generators paid for by humanitarian organizations have been distributed to vulnerable communities. School officials like Chris Musonye say having the water generator at his school has improved his learner's sanitation and academics. The time we used to waste going to look for water, we no longer run up and down looking for water because we have water in school. So that means the performance has to go up. A 2023 report by the World Health Organization found that worldwide about 1.4 million people die annually and 74 million have their lives shortened by diseases related to poor water access, sanitation and hygiene. Environmentalists say that as climate change increases water scarcity, inventing alternatives such as the device used by magic water is crucial. It is a practical process. Uh, issue is, is the cost of uh, learning such an equipment because actually it's like keeping your fridge open, keeping your fridge open overnight. In the morning there will be enough water for you to drink. So it's actually practical. It's very practical and it's a technology that we could probably enhance. Kenya's water sector authorities are funding farms to produce water, especially in marginalized areas. Willis Ombai is CEO of the government's Water Sector Trust Fund. He tells VOA that currently at least 42% of water delivered through traditional sources like pipes or wells is stolen or lost through leaks. They abstract water, they treat that water. Upon treatment, sometimes you find the water does not uh, finally reach um, the intended customers who are connected. It is either lost through physical leaks or commercial. Commercial could be cartels or people who are conspiring to defraud the companies of those revenues. Kenyan lawmakers are considering a bill that will privatize the water sector in hopes of sparring investment in the country's water sector. Now you can come and see how water is being collected. In the meantime, officials believe technologies like magic water can help boost access to clean water. Victoria Amunga, VOA News, Nairobi.